हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन माय लास्ट वीडियो आई हैड एक्सप्लेन्ड यू अबाउट द समरी ऑफ दिस चैप्टर एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू रीड दिस चैप्टर एंड डू टफ वर्ड्स एंड देयर मीनिंग आल्सो सो लेट्स स्टार्ट सूफी कुडंट स्लीप अ ब्रिलियंट मूनबीम वाज स्लैंटिंग थ्रू अ cap in the curtains it was shining right on to her pillow so students you can see here i had underlined two words moonbeam and slanting so meaning of moonbeam is ray of moonlight and slanting means position in a sloping direction so here sufi couldn't sleep because ray of moonlight was shining right on to her pillow okay the other children in the dormitory had been asleep for hours sophie closed her eyes and lay quite still she tried very hard to doze off here meaning of dormitory means a large bedroom and doze off means for sleep so the other children in the dormitory had been asleep but sophie tried very hard to doze off next it was no good the moonbeam was like a silver blade slicing through the room on to her face so slicing means cutting through so the ray of moonlight was like a silver blade which cutting through the room on to sophie face the house was absolutely silent no voices came up from downstairs there were no footsteps on the floor above either so here i had underlined absolutely downstairs and footsteps so absolutely means totally downstairs means the ground floor and footsteps means a step taken by a person in walking so students the house was completely silent no voices came up from the ground floor and even there were no footsteps on the floor means the house was totally silent next the window behind the curtain was wide open but nobody was walking on the pavement outside no cars went by on the street not the tiniest sound could be heard anywhere sophie had never known such a silence so here underline words are pavement and tiniest so pavement means path next to a road and tiniest means very small so the students the window behind the curtain was open but nobody was walking on the road no cars went by on the street and even a very small sound small sound could be heard anywhere and sophie had never known such a silence next perhaps she told herself this was what they called the witching hour so students witching hour means midnight or you can say devil's hour 
okay so sophie talking to herself and telling that this r is called witching r means r of devil r next the witching r somebody had once whispered to her was a special moment in the middle of the night when every child and grown up was in a deep deep sleep and all the dark things come out from hiding and had the world to themselves so here students i had underlined whisper and moment so whispered means to speak very quietly okay and moment means a very brief period of time so students the witching about the witching hour somebody had once whispered to sophie and that was a special moment in the mid of the night okay the moonbeam was brighter than ever on sophie's pillow she decided to get out of bed and close the gap in the curtains so here i had underlined brighter brighter means reflecting too much light so the moon wa beam was reflecting much light on sophie's pillow so sophie decided to close the gap in the curtains now you got punished if you were caught out of bed after lights out even if you shed you had to go to the lavatory that was not accepted as an excuse and they punished you just the same but there was no one about no sophie was sure for that so student here i had underlined lavatory accepted and excuse so lavatory means bathroom accepted means believed and excuse means justify so here uh, here is that students uh, uh, children are get caught punished if they were caught out of bed after lights off and if even if they said that they had to go to the laboratory that excuse was also not be accepted ek second look accepted and they punished by just the same and shofi was also sure that there was no one about no okay